Pangan Project is an activist organization here on the island engaged with some of the social, cultural, and environmental issues. Our mission is to help people connect with themselves, with the natural environment, and with their global community. And we're doing so through a series of programs. Um, mainly, we're involved in permaculture uh, education. The environment here is very extreme. It's very lush and beautiful and you wouldn't know it, but actually growing food here is a very big challenge. Permaculture is basically a design system, which is trying to model natural systems. We walk through that forest, what do we see? What plants are growing? What does the soil look like? Why are these plants growing in this arrangement? And then basically we come back here and we try to model some of those things that this natural environment does. I am working on volunteer organization. During the application process, we ask them what they like to do, what they like to spend their time on, and what they're good at. So we kind of have an idea of where they might fit, but we give them a day or two to really float around the project and see what's happening and see what they resonate with. They completely shape the project just by the events that they coordinate and the work that they do, the ideas they come up with, but um, I feel we give them a sense of community when they come here. People are really great, especially because we're all doing our own projects, and it's really inspiring to be able to feed off that kind of energy. I think one of the coolest things about the project is, is uh, there's no finite rules, so we're able to cultivate and change the project to what we envision that positive change should be. I was looking to volunteer with eco-related projects. I wanted to mainly get in touch with recycling. We have to sort it and give the proper disposal for it. So we're selling to recycling stations, we're trying to reuse what we have here. Even though what I am doing here won't affect the whole world, I believe that I can affect my neighbor, that can affect his neighbor. For the first couple of months I've been learning the different Thai vegetables and greens and stuff, organic stuff that comes from the island. And my goal is to take that food along with my influences from other restaurants that I've worked in and make a different cuisine here. Food is based around community. Meals are communal times, or social times, or time to nourish yourself and your body and your soul. I can give the Thai lesson for the people that come to the project so they can learn more about Thai people and the culture. I feel proud when someone like interested to our language, you know, like uh, I feel like you want to know something about our country. We at Pangan Project um, consider ecotourism more than just going into some forest or uh, see some waterfall. We also want to teach people a little bit, to educate them, not only about the plants and the animals, but also about some historical facts. Ecotourism does include also talking about the local traditions, meet the local people. Uh, in the uh, in my farm uh, uh, five years, Pangan project help me uh, give volunteer for me help me difficult for make farm. I have uh, me and uh, my husband. Uh, I have a volunteer come help me and we can uh, make more. Yeah, I want uh, make a uh, healthy. Yeah, and uh, 
and I, I want to give uh, uh, healthy uh, for people in the Kopangan. It's an ongoing, ever-changing experience for everyone, myself included. I'm learning tons about food, about community, about other people. Yeah, the projects, I, I feel it, um, it has lots of potential and uh, I like where it's going and I like that I feel I have a part in it. Mm -hmm.